guys, I know my sister made a video a while back about Anna probs, so I'm gonna make a video about Elsa probs. So first I wanna start off with everybody always thinking that I'm mean. Whenever we were kids, while we were growing up, for me and Anna, I wasn't being mean and I wasn't trying to hurt my sister by shutting her out. I was doing her a favor because I didn't want to freeze her and I didn't want to freeze the entire kingdom. But guess what? She let the cat out of the bag and that's exactly what happened. I froze her and I froze the entire kingdom. So that wasn't my fault because I was trying to prevent that but nobody would let me prevent that. Everybody loves me because I have ice powers. And that is a problem because there's so much other things that go on in Frozen in the movie besides me having ice powers like Anna and Anna risking her life to come save me and try to get me back and try to save Arendelle. What about that? Why does Anna not get that recognition? I don't need the recognition just because I'm blonde and I have ice powers. Another thing, everybody always asks me why when we were little did I hurt my sister? I didn't hurt her on purpose. I accidentally hit her in the head with my ice powers because she was jumping fast between the different snow mounds and I was trying to keep up with her and make the other ones catch her underneath. So I slipped on the ice and I, a piece of power came out and it hit her in the head. I didn't do it on purpose. Makes me mad when people think I did it on purpose. It was an accident. Another thing that always happens is a lot of people tell me how skinny I am and they always tell me that I need to eat a sandwich. Okay, well, if I'm gonna eat my sandwich, I'll probably eat your sandwich too because I like sandwiches and so does Anna. We all like sandwiches here in this house. So stop telling me that I need to eat a sandwich because I'm skinny. I'm fine, I eat perfectly fine. But I also work out because I'm very motivated and I try to keep up with myself. So stop telling me to eat a sandwich. Everybody also loves me, I'm their favorite, but let's think about how long I was actually in the movie for. So I'm probably in the movie at like 25% of the movie, whereas Anna and Kristoff and Olaf and Sven are in the movie like 89% of the time. And I just have like 25% of it, not even 25%, like 17% like I'm in the movie. Why are you so obsessed with me? So I have another one. So Anna gets a guy at the end. She gets Kristoff. They fall in love and they're still together to this day or whatever, I don't know. So people always ask me when I'm gonna get a man. And so I'm a queen, I'm already coronated and I'm a queen and I'm already running this kingdom and I don't need a man beside me. I don't need a king. I don't need somebody beside me to help run Arendelle. I can do this on my own. And I would like for everybody to stop asking me when I'm getting married. So I'm sure you guys have seen all of the toys and all of the dolls and Barbies and everything that's come out of me. And I know that this is my most famous dress, but I like other colors too. Like when I got my frozen fever dress, that is my absolute favorite colors. The turquoise with the pink my favorite but I also like green and I like oranges and pinks and reds and I like other colors so why can't I have variations of other other colors why can't I have a dress in a different color could you imagine this in pink but now I just sound like Aurora because she has pink and blue and it goes back and forth and she can't make up her mind well no that was Meriwether and Flora so this has been part one of Elsa Probs. There may be a part two, but I'm gonna sit and think about other things to come up with and write down that make me mad, that I find a problem with. Thank you for watching, it's been wonderful.